Hello, my wee darlings. How's everybody's Tuesday? I guess I made it back round to Tuesday, didn't I? <sighs> Today was an all right day. It was a little wee bit cold because we're having another little wee snap coming through tonight. And then hopefully we're going to get some 40s and 50s in the next couple of days. And maybe we can actually have some springtime instead of, you know, winter. <clears throat> but, of course, in Colorado, spring can mean anything between 75 degrees and 40 or 20 or 10. Snow, rain, sunshine. Um, yesterday's zipping was great. Uh, it was still a little chilly outside. If the sun was shining, like, it melted all the snow off the hill. We only got, like, four inches at the hill. I got a foot at my house <laughs> and two foot drifts, um, which was super fun. But uh, most of that has melted away because, again, I have a self-facing house. I didn't realize that that was awesome when we got the house, but hey, whatever. Morgan's getting crazy. Okay. Anyway, fun stuff. So um, I had a fun occurrence today. I'll try and tell the story as fast as I can. So um, the Jeep that we have at the hill, Dandelion, uh, went in for her yearly spa treatment. And I don't know what they did to the Jeep, if they did anything. Um, but we they didn't reset the trip odometer, which the gas tank doesn't work. Uh, the gas gauge doesn't work. So we have to go off of mileage. Well, she was at 102 miles. And we were like, mm, shield. Because she can get anywhere from like... 80 to 120 somewhere in a tank depending on how everything's running and working so um and how many tours and everything like that highway miles non-highway miles anyway so we were like we better go get some gas and we were driving people and doing a big group of things so we ran to um the gas station that's in manitou springs which is where we always go to get gas no problem so we go george hops out <clears throat> and he Gets gas. Now, mind you, this Jeep looks like it is super, like, decked out because it has aftermarket, like, bed and stuff on it. But it's really just a two-door JK, and it's like a 2010-2011. So it's, um, it's, it's just a JK. It's, it's, it's stock suspension, wheels, all that kind of stuff, tires. Um, I mean, obviously the tires aren't the original ones. They're a little bit beefier, but anyway, like it's not souped up, souped up. Like it's not like, ugh. so anyway, I'm driving, no big deal. I have my hair just up in a ponytail, not fancy, not pretty, not down, just up in a regular ponytail. I'm not looking cute today. Just I'm work. I'm at work. So we try to get gas. It's full. No problem. So George gets in the seat and I'm taking off to drive and we're waiting to turn left to go back toward the hill. Um, on Manitou Avenue and this truck with two guys and it comes pulling in and I'm sitting there and the guy has his window down and he looks and he looks over at me and I look over at him just kind of like okay like yeah and he's staring at me and he goes holy shit or something like that all excited <laughs> and um George is like the seats that are in the back of this jeep are kind of raised up so he kind of looks over and he's like yeah buddy good <laughs> and the guy was just like looked over at his buddy or something because like I fully like watched him turn in he's like holy shit I don't know if he was talking about the jeep or me but that shit made me laugh like a mother like I had a belly rolling laugh for a good two minutes because his reaction George's reaction <laughs> and I just tried off <laughs> And, um, <laughs> and I laughed as soon as I heard whatever he said. I'm not exactly sure, but I just started laughing because I'm like, what? What was that? <laughs> but I, la I laughed the whole way back to the hill because it was hilarious that he did that. Like, sometimes the reactions that men give me because I'm driving a Jeep, it is just priceless. And it makes me laugh. And I think it's great. Because they're like, oh my god. Boys, just wait until I get my lift and my tires and everything else that I'm going to be doing to Viserion. Okay? Then you're going to see me driving that big boy around town and be like, hey girl, hi. And I'm going to be like, mm -mm, Luno. 
You driving a little yee yee truck? No. Come at me with a built up Jeep and show me you know how to wheel. We can talk, but no. Mm -mm, no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> but I'll drive around in my Jeep. <sighs> Super awesome. Anyway. Pied resistance for the night. Sorry, I'm kind of a mess, but I had to put my hair down for this. Um, I went to the gym tonight, of course. <laughs> so, um, anyway, my best friend, um, decided to drop off my presents at my house because I didn't know what time I was going to be home. So she dropped it off. And I just want to show you guys some of the things that my best friend got me. Um, unfortunately, she won't see this because she's not on social media. So I have to send her like a screenshot of everything because it's freaking awesome. So um, we did a root beer challenge a couple of years ago to like taste a bunch of different root beers. And one of our favorites, this is the same company. So she got me orange cream and then lemon limeade. So um, I will be trying those at some point soon. But um, not tonight because I just took my post-workout. And if I have anything else, it hurts my tummy. Then... Um, I got a stemless wine glass for Christmas that said my name on it, and then it said Mother of Dragons, and this apparently was the original thing she ordered, but it got lost in the mail, but then it got shipped anyway. So, this is a beautiful wine glass goblet that has my name on it, and then it says Mother of Dragons. So, I love that. And of course, oh God. <clears throat> I got me a fascinator, you know, wear it so, you know, when I need to wear it to my next ex-boyfriend's uh, funeral because I might have to kill him. Uh, not that I have one now, but, you know, future. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> so, photo shoots, things like that. And then this one. <laughs> oh, she got me this. Check that out. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, that is a dragon ring. I like it. I love dragons. If you didn't know, I love dragons. And then, are you ready for this? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh God, Morkin's not ready. <laughs> yes, queen. <laughs> Can I wear this to work? <laughs> mm. That's why I had to put my hair down. Because it looks so much better with the hair down. Right? <laughs> yes. Kill the mold. <laughs> okay. I just had to show you my massively beautiful tiara crown. It's not a full crown. It is a tiara because it does come down on the sides. But, oh my god. Girl, check that out. It's so sparkly. Ooh. Y'all don't need to be looking at my nose. Okay, sorry about that. Don't look at my nose, girls. Look at that. Look at how pretty. Oh. I might have to, like, add some seashells to it or something and put it into my mermaid collection. I don't know. But that thing, it's heavy, too. That thing is massive. It's massive. Anyway, I had to share that with you. Oh. I hope you're having a wonderful, lovely, darling Tuesday. Um. Yeah. I'll be working for the next like three weeks straight because apparently y'all is on spring break and y'all is wanting to come ziplining and that's cool and I'm happy to have you. Y'all just come right on out, that's fine. But I just want you to know that we need two teens every day and uh, we're a little short staffed. So guess who gets to work every day? That's all right, you know what that means. Girl, that means more hours, that means more tips, and that means that my paycheck can be a little bit bigger, which means mama can buy herself a shoe. Maybe not two, but one for sure. Right? Okay. Oh, also, yes, fancy. All right, so I guess when I get birthday presents, I get, you know, the good stuff. <laughs> like tiaras. All right, y'all, I'm putting my hair back up. I'm going to go finish cleaning my house because I got Airbnb guests coming tomorrow. And then I'm going to take a shower and I'm going to bed because this girl got to be at the chiropractor at 7.30 in the morning. And I missed it this morning because I'm retarded. So, I'm going to go light some more shit on fire. Oh, speaking of lighting things on fire, I had a lamp and it wasn't working right. And it just like wouldn't turn on and it was on a little timer thing, whatever. 
So I tried just plugging it straight into the wall. I lit that thing on fire. <laughs> well, um, it didn't quite go on fire because it was in an extra thing that had a grounder on it. Thank Jesus. Oh, God, because I could have lit my whole house on fire. I don't know why. Couldn't tell you why. I'm not an electrician. But I plugged it into the main thing, and it went, <laughs> and I was like, oh, shit. Had to unplug everything real quick. Um, luckily, it was one of those additional things that was grounded, so it wasn't the actual socket. It was an additional one that was in the socket. That thing's in the trash because it blow up. Ooh, kitty's in the window. Okay. How much for the kitty in the window? <laughs> All right, y'all. I done talked your ears off for a while. This is probably going to end up going on the tube of use since my new phone doesn't like to upload videos very well. So enjoy. See you guys later. <laughs>